As a user, you connect to a stream using a workspace where you check out and submit files just as you would to a set of depot files in Classic Perforce. There are subtle differences in how you use workspaces between Classic Perforce and Perforce streams. For example, in streams, the stream view defines the scope of files contained in a stream and is set by default to the scope of files defined in the parent stream's view. The client view defines the scope of files accessible from within a user's workspace. In streams, the client view is preset based on the stream view defined by the stream creator and cannot be modified by the user. The stream creator can modify the scope and capabilities of files contained in the stream using path types when defining the stream view. In general, the stream creator can refine the view of a child stream to restrict the scope of editable and submittable files in the client view, but cannot expand the scope of editable and submittable files beyond that defined by the parent view. The stream creator can also extend the scope of files in a stream view by importing files from other streams, making them visible in the client view. Imported files are not editable or submittable. Imported files are represented with a special icon to differentiate them from editable and submittable files. The stream creator might make a third-party library part of an imported file set in the stream view. The stream creator can also further restrict the stream view by excluding files contained in the parent stream. Excluded files are not visible in the client view for a stream workspace even though they exist in the parent stream. This behavior is a bit different from Classic Perforce where you can configure your client view to include any of the files in the depot for which you have access permissions. With streams, as a user, what you see is what you get in respect to the client view. Having a preset client view makes it easier for you to set up a workspace and streamlines the administration of workspaces across users. The preset client view also helps ensure that the integrity of the flow of change established for the stream remains intact. The stream workspace model prevents you from simultaneously editing a set of associated files distributed across several streams. With streams, to edit a set of files across multiple streams, you typically move your workspace around the individual streams that contain the associated files and edit them, one stream at a time. The process for switching a workspace between streams is easy and very fast. Because changes to stream views impact the associated client view, before narrowing the scope of a stream view for a live stream, you should make certain that there are no checked out files in the affected area of the view before you modify the view. Removing a set of files from the stream view that are checked out in an associated workspace can orphan the checked out files as the users working on the files will no longer be able to submit them since they are no longer part of the child view.